It would be hard to tell whether his team had won the game or not, right? Not a whole lot of emotion. But what if, for just a moment, he threw caution to the wind and told us how he really felt about this perfect season? We asked Bob Ryan over the Globe 10.0 in today's Extra Point. Gentlemen. Thanks, Hazel. Bob Ryan and Charlie Pierce here for our Globe 10.0 Extra Point question. Now, Bill Belichick, we know, is a historian of this game of football. Do you think if we could get him in a candid moment, how would he feel about coaching a team to an undefeated season? Yes, you think he really wants this, this guy, in his this, heart? I would say his heart of hearts. This guy, this guy is competing in his mind, not, not, against, not just against Tony Dungy or Jack Del Rio. Right. He's competing in his mind against Bill Parcells, against Bill Walsh, Jerry against Paul Howells. Brown, That's right. Jerry Charles. Oh, I once, his, I once his made his the hero, mi- by the way, is yeah, Paul Brown. I, yeah, I once made the mistake of referring to uh, Bill Walsh as having invented the West Coast offense, ah! and I got a 10-minute, very erudite dressing you down right. about who actually had invented the West Coast offense, and it was Paul Brown. And he was at, he knows. I mean, do you think in the back of his mind, He's not thinking, you know, Parcells never did this. Oh, Parcells. You know, Parcells will have to talk about me having an undefeated team. So you would be gobsmacked if... Uh, in a 15 and 0 situation, uh, Tom Brady isn't taking at least three quarters worth of snaps against the New York Giants. I, I, I think, first of all, I think you'd have to knock him senseless to keep him from doing that. Uh, second of all, uh, you know, because you know, nothing inspires the quarterback get, like playing badly, which was last week. But I think, I think Belichick knows exactly what the kind. I mean, he's the, the man knows more about the history of football than anybody alive. Of if, course, he knows his place. If in and it. when it happens, you know, and and it's uh, now about 10 o'clock on the evening of, of uh, Eastern Time in Glendale, Arizona, February 3rd. Will he admit? That he wanted this all along. He looked like he was admitting it on the way across the field Sunday, didn't yeah, he? Well, no, that was a funny grin. I mean, he did everything. He did everything but turn a handspring. That was a very, very spooky grin. All right, back to you, Hazel.